Texas Stadium in Irving, Texas is sold out today for the 59th renewal of one of the keenest rivalries in the NFL history, the Washington Redskins versus the Dallas Cowboys. And the debut in regular season of Troy Aikman, an impressive rookie who passed for 241 yards last week. Third down and nine, Monty Coleman in defensively for Washington. Three wide receivers for the Cowboys. Pressure on Aikman. And Todd Bowles gets there first on a safety blitz. Big loss on the play. Well, the Skins came with the blitz from Bowles and from uh, number 31, Clarence Vaughn. Here's number 23 from the left of your screen coming in here, and he is just unblocked all the way. There's just not enough Cowboys to uh, pick him up. First and 10 on the 29 of the Cowboys. Play fake. Man is in there. And Aikman gets rid of it. No flag down. I believe they're going to call it. He was in the grasp there. Pat Harder, our referee, That's right. came up and marked him down. Second down and 15. Aikman's pass is intercepted by Alvin Walton. And he'll go in for a Washington touchdown. Twenty nine yard return by Alvin Walden. The Redskins want to double Herschel Walker out of the backfield here. Watch Alvin Walton come over and pick this ball off. In and out coverage for Monty Coleman on the outside number fifty one and there's Walton just reading the quarterback's eyes. Double coverage on Walker and this is a walk in for Walton. Chip Lowmiller converts. And it's now 7-0 in favor of the Redskins with exactly nine minutes remaining in the first quarter. Marshall and Walton, big plays in that sequence for the Redskins. Aikman under pressure, throwing deep, intended for Alexander and covered by A.J. Johnson. Incidental contact, no penalty there, and that will bring a fourth down. Joe Howard goes back. Mike Saxon will boot it for the Cowboys. And they're going to fake punt. Saxon is not going to make it. Terry Orr alertly stops Saxon from getting the necessary yardage for the first down, and the Redskins will take over deep in Dallas territory. This is number 47, A.J. Johnson, who had just made the play on the defense. He comes in clear and forces Saxon to take off running with this ball. He didn't get him the first time, but he's right in on this time. Bates couldn't make the block, and now the pursuit catches up with Saxon, and Terry Orr makes the play. First down, Redskins on the Cowboy 30. Rippin has Clark. And Clark very nearly got away from three defenders. Vince Albright finally made the stop. Dean Hamill, former teammate of Clark, also found him to be slippery. Griffin under pressure. Fumbles. Jim Jeffcoat. And no flags are down. Touchdown, Cowboys. Seven yards that matches the number on his back. Now, this is something that has bothered Rippin throughout his career is hanging onto the ball in the pocket when he gets contact. Ray Horton on the safety blitz. And how many times have we seen Jim Jeffcoat either pick up a deflected pass out of the air from Too Tall Jones or a fumble and run it in for a touchdown? But Jim Jeffcoat, 77 yards, and the Cowboys make the first big, big play. Jim Jeffcoat, who has scored two touchdowns previously, chalks up another to tie this one up at 7-all. This is the uh, Norton and Horton show. This is Ken Norton, and Ray Horton is going to come from the outside. Riggs is going to step up and block Ken Norton, and uh, Ray Horton is going to come in and knock the quarterback. And look at this great bounce. Just a one-hopper. Taylor made. Griffin is one for six for only 16 yards thus far. Six defensive backs in there for the Cowboys. 
Pippen has Monk wide open. He'll have the first down. And he is tackled just short of midfield by Robert Williams. That's good for 16 yards, and the Redskins will keep possession. Uh, this is just a terrible coverage job by the Cowboys as both of them, the safeties, uh, head out there for Ricky Sanders and they leave Monk, of all people, wide open on a third medium. Third down and five at the 47. Six defensive backs for Dallas. Rippin has an open man, Ricky Sanders, and he finds it good enough for the first down. A 17-yard pickup to the 30. Robert Williams on the stop. Rippin has Art Monk. First down at the 15-yard line. Slant pattern, and Robert Williams on the tackle. Good for 10, 10 yards, and that's the third time the Redskins have converted on third down in this drive. Redskins have been successful inside the 20 so far this season. On the delay, Finer, he'll get in there. Touchdown, Redskins. 12 yards, and Washington takes the lead. It's an inside handoff to Ernest Finer here, and there is just nobody on the outside. The Cowboys again coming on the blitz. Johnson said he wanted to blitz more, but what happens without team speed? Good example of it here. Biner out races all Britain for the corner of the end zone. So Ernest Biner, who caught a touchdown pass against the Eagles, now runs for one. And he's a guy who performed both duties for the Browns, but he won't carry it that much for the Redskins. Chip Lowmiller kick was good at 14 to 7, not in the one back offense. And that is the end of the first quarter here at Texas Stadium with the score. The Redskins 14 and the Cowboys 7. Look at that stack on the right side. Three wide receivers, something new for the Redskins on third and four. And Art Monk gets away from the defender. And finally brought down, he broke Everson Wall's tackle and Art Monk with a 40-yard gain. And the Redskins are in business again at the 35-yard line of Dallas. They call these guys the posse. Three wide receivers, probably the best trio in the entire league. But again, it's third and short or third and medium, and they're going to go to their third and medium guy, and that's Art Monk. That's two missed tackles today for Everson Walls. And uh, Monk is looking like that fullback that used to play at Syracuse right there. Morris <laughs> gets the call. Now to the 30-yard line. Making the tackle, Randy Shannon. Double tight end on second and four of the Cowboy 29. Griffin. He's got some room. Penalty marker down, and Rippin slides at the 20. It'll be enough for a first down by plenty. Redskins have converted the last four third down attempts. Rippin going for Clark, and it's incomplete. Williams covering on the play. Chip Lowmiller will try a 27-yarder. He is two for three thus far this season. Washenko, the cover will hold. The kick is good, and the Redskins add to their lead. And now it's the Redskins 17 and the Cowboys 7. Now it's third down. They're getting down low on the clock. Aikman going deep for Kelvin Martin, and the pass is intercepted by Bowles, I believe. Todd Bowles picks it off for the Redskins. You can say it's as good as a punt. You can say it's as good as a punt, but as a quarterback, you, you hate to throw an interception at any time. Aikman is throwing this ball into nothing but trouble. There are three Redskins that had a shot at this one and only one Cowboy. And Bowles is right there playing center field as he should. Kelvin Martin didn't have any choice but to just make the tackle. The Redskins have dominated with strong defense. That is the end of the first half. All right, let's take a look at some halftime statistics, which, of course, is uh, not surprisingly would favor the Redskins. They have the big edge in rushing yards and passing yards. A rollout, Hendricks chasing Rippin, and this pass is caught by Art Monk. It'll be a Redskin first down on third and long. Ron Francis on the stop at the 40-yard line, and a 19-yard pickup to Art Monk having a terrific day. Watch this ball come from shadow to light. Art Monk does a nice job of keeping it, but also a good play call here. The, Cow the Redskins offensive coaches anticipated 
the Cowboys coming with a blitz. They called the controlled roll out there to Rippon, and they came away with a big play. Three wide receivers again for the Redskins. Rippon to Biner. First down, Redskins. Ernest Biner with a fine catch. Vince Albritton on the tackle in the Dallas territory, and that should move the stick. Second down, 10. Rippon under pressure. Gets it to Morris. Morris close to another first down for the Redskins. Just outside the Dallas 40. Ray Hoyt with a strong safety knocked him out of bounds. First down on the 37 of the Cowboys. Rippon with time. And Morris holds on to the ball and picks up about eight yards on that. Randy Shannon makes the stop on Jamie Morris. Morris pings his way into a terrific job, gets another first down for the Redskins. The time of possession, 27 minutes to just under 12 for Dallas. Big edge to the Redskins. On third down and six, Griffin. And the defender fell down. And Ricky Sanders was wide open in the end zone. And the Dallas defender had slipped. Ron Francis, and if the pass had been there, it would have been an easy touchdown. Sanders and Francis kind of get tangled up a little bit. As Sanders is going to the corner there, he stumbles a little bit, and Rippon, knowing that the blitz was coming, didn't have enough time to set himself and deliver a good pass. Chip Lomiller will try a field goal from 37 yards out. Holding will be Marcienko. And the kick is up. It's good. And the Redskins have added to their lead. And it's now 20 to 7, Washington. Third down and 16, back up to the seven now, is Troy Aikman. Aikman fires it out, and Herschel Walker can't hold on, and that'll bring up fourth down. There's Mr. Shula and Mr. Johnson. Looking for answers uh, right now. They are having a lot of problems out there. That is the end of the third quarter with the score. The Washington Redskins 20 and the Dallas Cowboys 7. Steve Walsh, who this week said he wanted to be traded, that won't happen, makes his first appearance of the season. First down on the 35, and that sure did get a rise out of this capacity crowd. Walsh to throw again. Tip, and it's intercepted. Charles Mann or Daryl Grant? It was Daryl Grant who picks it up, and it's Washington ball. Well, this is just rotten luck for Steve Walsh. This ball is bounced up in the air, and Grant makes the interception. Roderick Sargent just wasn't quite ready for this pass, and Walsh was under some pressure to get it away fast. Charles Mann again just throwing Kevin Gogan down and now laying into Steve Walsh. Dallas 36. Jamie Morris knocks the defenders back several yards. Tremendous power by a small sized running back. And Randy Shannon gets credit for the tackle. Pick up of about eight yards. On the counter, Jamie Morris is going to score for the Redskins. Who pad their lead. 12-yard touchdown run by Jamie Morris. And with Riggs out, other backs are getting their chance today, such as Morris and Ernest Biner. Again, it's a counter gap play. We're going to see Lachey and Raleigh McKenzie. Now, this play can go up inside, but uh, that's where all the Cowboys are. Morris bounces it to the outside. Touchdown, Redskins. <laughs> Low Miller having a fine day, kicks the conversion to make it 27 to 7 in favor of the Redskins. Three interceptions by the Redskin defense. Two of them resulted in touchdown. Walton returned one for a 29-yard score. And after Darrell Grant's pick, Jamie Morris scored moments later. Very disappointed ball club looking there on the uh, sidelines, looking out onto the field. Third down and two at the 23, and the pass 
Kevin Scott. He caught it, but it looks shy of the first down. Now Jerry Jones is on the sideline, and Dan, we didn't think he was going to be down there today. Well, we had uh, a very special guest who tossed the coin before the game, Elizabeth Taylor, and she was sitting up in the box with Jerry Jones. This tells me one of two things. Liz is either gone. <laughs> she saw enough. <laughs> I think she's seen enough of this game. Fourth down and one for the Cowboys with nothing to lose. Double tight end for Dallas. Herschel Walker and a miss handoff. And they're not going to make it. So uh, the roof is caving in. On the 18 of the Cowboys, third down and four. On the delay, Morris looking for room. He's short of the first down. On fourth down, Low Miller will try the field goal. Washenko will hold. This will be a 33-yard attempt. Low Miller two for two thus far this afternoon. And Chip's kick is good. He's off to a fine start. He's five for six on the year. And the Redskins have now extended their lead to 30 to seven over the Dallas Cowboys. Come on, Redskins! First down and 15. Walsh throws it into the hands of Wilbur Marshall. And Wilbur Marshall rambles into Dallas territory. And another turnover. That's the fourth of the game. Four interceptions by the Redskins. Walt, Bowl, Grant, and Marshall all picked one off today as the Redskins win it 30-7.